Today we're working on a KVF 750, which is a Brute Force 750. This is 2007. Wanted to do a quick video on how to put a different bearing in on this side of the casing. And what you do is you use a hone, a hone like this one. And what you have to do is you have to hone out the case itself before you put the bearing in. So you hone it out. Once you hone it, you want to make it so that this bearing just fits in real simple, real easy. Then you put the bearing on the crank and then you push the casing onto it. And as long as it pushes on real easy and after you're done pushing it, if this, this moves like it should, you'll be fine. If it's real tight and it's real hard to get back on, then you have to hone this out a little more, make it a little bit bigger, because this bearing itself will expand a little bit. And if you notice, when you put this bearing onto the crankshaft itself, by itself, it actually has to expand in order to get on it normally. And so the manual tells you differently. The manual says that you have to actually replace the casing itself and buy a new one that has a bearing already installed. Well, you can buy the bearing by itself, hone it out a little bit, push it in. Uh, some people like to put Loctite on it to keep it in there. And once you push it in and it sits real nice, then you got it. And that's how you replace that bearing inside of there. I don't think anybody ever says any of this stuff. Usually everyone just goes by the manual and the manual tells you to actually replace the whole entire casing. So. Hopefully this helps out anybody out there working on a Brute Force 750. Probably the same exact thing with a 650. Good luck.